Hello and welcome to today's video. So, today's video, we are doing a little get ready with me for a birthday party we are attending tonight as a family. Yeah, it's gonna be a fun time. It is like a semi-formal event. They're doing it at one of the country clubs here in Vegas. So it should be a good time. Um, so yeah, so it is about four o'clock right now. I just showered, um, I did my hair. Well, I didn't do my hair, I did like my hair care um i put this i got this new serum called the it's from mise en scene it's like a korean brand it's called the perfect serum but this is like the specifically the styling one um so it's supposed to hold whatever style you do for longer so i got that so i did that already i also wanted to just kind of share some skincare that i recently got i took advantage of the huge promotion that was happening at the end of July and I got myself the Medicube Air Shot. So that's this one and then the Booster. And so far I've literally only used, I've used the Air Shot only once so far. Um, and then the Booster I've used a couple times. I love it so far. Um, will I continue to love it? Not 100% sure, but I mean, I've only heard good things. So that's what we're going to do. We are going to use the Booster you use it to apply your skincare and it helps the absorption of said skincare by like 400 percent or something like that like something crazy so um i also got some skincare to go with it yeah i went a little medicube crazy um but i currently have no regrets so this is their collagen jelly cream this came as like a gift with purchase with the um air shot booster set this is very nice, but it definitely feels like a mask. And I I don't love like the feeling of it, like when it's on my face, cause it's kind of tacky, but it's beautiful. Like it's, I feel so like juicy and refreshed and moisturized and all that stuff um, after I use it. So it is what it is. But then I got the bubble serum so these next few products I have not tried before. So I got this bubble serum. So I'm excited to try that. I got the triple collagen toner. Heard really good things about this because I do, this is the toner I am currently using, the Sun By Me one, and I love it, um, but I am definitely almost out. So I was like, well, let's let's try this one out. Let's see. Um, then I got the, this is all the triple collagen line. Sorry if I didn't say that. Um, this is their serum. So I got this and I currently have on rotation the Clarins Double Serum for nighttime. And then I use the Dialba Spray Serum like for every day, like during the day, like before, because I don't want it to feel too heavy um, when I'm like out and about. So that, and then I also got the Triple Deep Erasing Cream. So like these three came in a set and then the bubble serum was a separate purchase. So what we are doing today, I think I'm gonna give the bubble, I'm gonna give this guy a shot with the Booster H, and then I'll just finish off with just my regular moisturizer and sunscreen, um, because it is, even though it's like an evening event, we are like, the sun doesn't set until like eight o'clock at the earliest. So um, I wanna make sure that fully protected. <laughs> so, all right, let's go ahead and do the skincare. <laughs> shake before you put on your hand and then spread on your face. Okay, so shake, 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 here we go. All right, so I'm gonna put the serum on the back of my hand here. Oh, oh! <laughs> okay, all right, I got that. Um, Then we're going to, first, I'm going to take the booster. I'm going to just like tap the serum like of a little too much. I'm gonna use it because we got it. All right, then I'm gonna turn it on. So you just hold this button. Okay. So first I'm gonna do, just get this all in. Spread it all around. So like if you watch like YouTube videos, either from Medicube or from like other like YouTubers and people who have like reviewed this, there's like different methods of getting everything in here. And 
So I'm just, right now I'm just working on getting it all spread out. So I believe the technique I'm currently using is called watering. So. so this is literally just to get it all. Now I'm still learning how to use this, so I am not the person to come to for how to use this quite yet. Oh gosh, okay. So then I'm gonna go into boosting mode where you just kind of sweep it across your face like that. And then I don't know if you heard it, but it like pretty much sets a timer for you because you should only use said product, um, said device for like five minutes at a time. And then the, the timer like basically tells you like you should move on to like another area of the face so that you get maximum absorption everything is in everything's good all that good stuff so I'm still like I said learning how to use this but we are doing it dab on my moisturizer real quick actually let's do that because can't hurt <laughs> five minutes passed okay yep so five minutes and it shuts up on its own and then for cleaning it, you literally just wipe the head um, and then store it away. <laughs> okay, so, Ooh, felt really good. Oh, okay, so I feel like I need to let this like bubble serum and like lotion sitch kind of blend in. So we're gonna like mush it together. Bye. Okay, it still feels a little tacky, but I think that's just also the nature of the serum. So I'm gonna rub that in. So we're gonna top this off with some sunscreen. I take a good amount. <laughs> okay, all right. While that is going to settle in, I'm going to quickly just give my hair um, a little dry because I'm going to use my Dyson Airwrap, but it's still a little bit too wet to start the curling. So let's do that. Okay, so my camera was overheating um, while I was doing my hair, but I went ahead and finished the other side. Nice bouncy curls. I haven't brushed through them and I don't think I will because I think they look pretty good right now. But let's, I am going to take these out. Ooh. <laughs> there we go. Um, and I'm, I think, I haven't decided if I want to do a product on top of it because I did put the serum first. So I might just let this kind of go. I am going to pin this part here for a little volume in the front. <laughs> and then I will just pin back my hair like so do my makeup 
<laughs> it's a look. It's a look. <laughs> My base that I've been doing lately, so I'm using the Say Slip Tint. It's like their tinted moisturizer with SPF and the say glowy gel so i've been mixing the two and that has been like my base combo especially because i'm not i don't want like a heavy heavy base especially during the hot summer months so we do one pump <laughs> hello so and then a pump of this together and then just Rub that all over with my hands. I have my NARS um, Radiant Creamy Concealer in Custard. Yeah, I use Custard. So we're gonna put a little bit under the eye, not too much, um, and then just a couple dots here and there, just to give a little bit of coverage where I need it. So we're just going to go in with blush and I use the Nearly Rose Cream Concealer from Rare Beauty. We have my Style Nanda uh, Rose Latte Palette or 3CE Style Nanda. Um, we're just going to do, um, yeah, probably just these two bottom colors, nothing crazy. I don't need like a ton of makeup just to give a little bit of definition to the eyes. We're going to do, I focus it more towards the outside and then I just blend it in all over the lid. Man, like back in the day when I used to like do like full glam makeup, sometimes I'm like, God, how did I, how did I have time for that? Or like the energy to do that? And I'm like, well, yeah, it's because I was a teenager or in my 20s and you know didn't have a kid <laughs> so but you know what life is better now not even gonna pretend that i miss that because i don't um, then i'm gonna go in that with that brown color and do that that okay easy peasy and then i'm going to do my mac um gel eyeliner in dip down so i just do a very thin 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 normally on a like an everyday i wouldn't even go all the way in but maybe today i will okay and that's it super simple nothing crazy that's it for the eyes well I have to put on some mascara. I use the Clio Kill Lash. Um, it is not waterproof because I do not use waterproof because I feel like it's just so hard to get off. Um, and this actually does a pretty good job of holding the curl and also not transferring, especially on my super straight Asian eyelashes. So I like this mascara a lot. It's been one of my favorites for quite some time. I've tried others, but this is the one. And then um, the eyelash curl I'm using is the Shiseido one. Like I used to live and die by the Shuimura, but it was harder and harder to get my hands on that. So I switched over to Shado. Um, basically, as long as it's an Asian company making the curler, I'm fine. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot my glitter. Oh yeah, we gotta use this guy, right? This is a double note. Um, Normally I do like a bottom thing, so let's just stick with that. Should we go top? No, I think we'll do bottom. Just a little bit to make the eyes kind of pop. Like I love this stuff. It's so nice and like it's just gives you exactly the look that you want without going overboard. Okay. 
So I'm going to just chill like this for a little bit um, because I'm not ready to change yet, but I do need to get my toddler up from her nap. So we will continue the final look. It's basically just changing into our dresses <laughs> um, once I kind of do a couple of things. So be right back. Okay, so we are ready. I decided to go with my current favorite look, black bow, half up, half down. Um, I can't decide if I want to keep, like I might tuck these back in, but anyway, that's what's going on there. And then trying to see if I can, this is like, oh, you know what we'll do? Let's see. The full dress moment. Obviously we're still inside, so no shoes. Okay, so Bernard is just finishing up getting dressed and then we are headed out the door and let's let's go party. Let's go party, let's go celebrate her 103rd birthday. Woo! Hey. 